Hello and welcome back to my kitchen. Today we are going to be making a cozy soup perfect for January when we're all just snuggled in and hunkered down for the winter. We're going to be making a lasagna soup today. I know you're going to love it, so let's go ahead and get started. Soups are perfect for this time of year. We're all like hunger down and wanting to be all cozy with a big bowl of hearty soup. They make great leftovers. And I love that this reader recipe takes a somewhat complicated recipe like lasagna that can be very time consuming and makes it in soup form. So to get started, we're gonna go ahead and brown two pounds of ground beef and two pounds of hot Italian sausage in a large stock pot. As that's browning and cooking, you're gonna add one large purple or yellow onion that has been diced to the pot along with three tablespoons of minced garlic. While this is cooking, we're gonna prep our noodles at the same time. So to another large stock pot, fill it about halfway with water, set it on the stove on high heat and bring to a boil, heavily salt the water, and then cook the pasta until just al dente. After that's finished cooking, drain it and set it aside until needed here in a little bit. After the meat is cooked and fully browned, you're gonna drain off any excess fat and then add it back into the stock pot. From there, we're gonna add four cans of diced Italian tomatoes. Fill two of those cans with water and add to the pot and two large boxes of beef broth. Lastly, we're going to add all the seasonings. Two tablespoons of Italian seasoning and then salt and pepper to taste. Stir this all together and bring it to a low simmer. You can go ahead and add in the cooked noodles, stir it all together, and then the last thing that we're gonna do is the secret ingredient. You're gonna add about two cups of grated Parmesan cheese straight into the pot, stir it all together, and that's just gonna help round out the flavor, give it that classic cheesy lasagna taste that everybody loves. Spoon it out into a big old bowl, serve it with some hot buttered crusty sourdough bread for dipping. You can add a bit more of shredded mozzarella or Italian cheese on top, however you like it. It's delicious, it's warm, it's comforting. It's an easy way to make the classic lasagna casserole that everybody loves, but in a soup version for the winter. For the full recipe, head on over to KentuckyLiving.com. All the ingredients and instructions are lined out there. I hope you enjoy this recipe and feed it to your family this month. Thank you all for joining me in my kitchen today and until next month, I will talk to you all very soon. Bye-bye.